Creative Code is fundamentally a mode of expression that enables you to do things that you couldn't do just five, ten years ago. Taking the concepts of coding and how you make things, but applying it to a more creative approach, a purpose that isn't necessarily product-driven or financially driven, but more cathartic and a means of expression. Creative Code is what's sort of defining our current society. And I think when, when the future looks back at us in this information era, they're going to look back at, at the people making the art. Creative Code represents a real opportunity for people from a creative background to express themselves and kind of wield their influence in ways that they haven't really had access to before. When you're coding, there's a certain dynamism in that. You can interact and you can kind of predict and tell rules and states of things. But it's really hard to kind of get in, involved and start in that process. At Gray Area, it's extremely important for us to give people those tools to express themselves with code and with digital art. GAFTA offers a lot of great services, um, workshops and events here in San Francisco, but there are a lot of other people that are really interested in these types of things. There are a bunch of people that just approach creative code and technology in a really, really unique way. So I see tremendous value and bringing that online. We really, really want to reach people that have never heard of creative code and just want to like dabble in it and learn things and be inspired to create art with code. I think that if anyone wants to support their arts foundry, one of the first places to do that is education foundations. When we started Gray Area's education program, it was a bunch of passionate and enthused individuals. We'd love to widen that community with your support. With your support, Gray Air can continue to fund artists. You can get involved by taking a class. And you can also get involved by you know, offering a small donation on our site, either through creativecode.io or grayarea.org.